Good afternoon. Uh, today is June 19th, 2013, um, Wednesday. I am speaking with Mr. Kamal Lohani from Bangladesh, of Bangladesh, but I'm, this interview is being taken in New Jersey. <coughs> Mr. Lohani, uh, where is your desh? Not desh kothe. I'm a desh to Bangladesh. And in Bangladesh? Uh, I mean, in Bangladesh, uh, my uh, own district is Sirajganj. Sirajganj. And in Sirajganj? And Sirajganj? The, uh, in, uh, uh, what should I say? Uh, it is Upojela. Upojela. Sab, sab. Uh, Ulla Pada. Ulla Pada. Uh, and the name of the village is Shontala. Shontala. Okay. Very nice. Did you grow up there? Was it a small village or large village? Uh, medium. medium. Uh, so, yeah. how was your house like? Was it a brick building? Was it a mud building? Uh, uh, bamboo building? Tin no, room? no. It is a tin. Uh, it was a tin shed. Tin shed. Typical of Bengal. Uh, tin, tin, typical Bengali style. And uh, I was there uh, uh, up to. Uh, six. Six. Uh, when I was you, six. You went to school there? Uh, I went to primary right. school. Do you remember the name of the school? Uh, uh, that is uh, Suntala Primary School. Primary school, okay. And, and, and then after that? After that I had to uh, leave that village because my fa mother was uh, mother was not uh, yet, uh, there. She died. Uh, so uh, we were living in one family, mm -hmm. so my father thought that uh, I should not be here. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, I should be sent to uh, uh, my uh, auntie, Aunt. uh, who was living in Calcutta. In Calcutta, uh, and this is this so, is before forty-seven uh, partition. Uh, yeah, right? yeah. I, I went there in nineteen forty-three. Okay, so it's a United uh, India, United uh, Bengal. Uh, yes, yeah, United yeah. Bengal yeah. during Second World War. Second World War, okay. And uh, the, 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 the the time I had been to Calcutta, uh, it was almost uh, every day we were just uh, yeah uh, watching. Uh, Japanese planes are oh, flying over the yes. Did you did you and go to school uh, bombing, there? Yeah, okay, tell yeah. us about the bombing and uh, your, yeah. your your mm -hmm. what did you do? Were you hiding? Mm -hmm. Were you going? Uh, going to the uh, strange? No. Oh. Uh, in near Park, Park Sagar Smadan. Oh, I see. <laughs> so you live near Park Sagar. Did you go yes, to school uh, there? Yes, Kimber Street. Did you go to school there? Oh yes, uh, I had been to Shishu Bidapit. Shishu Bidapit. Uh, it is being. Uh, Run by the Maharani of Kuch Bihar. Maha, I see. Near, in, what, it was near uh, uh, Patsakas, that area? Oh, yes. Congress Exhibition now, Road. Now, tell me, the, I'll let me go back. The village you lived in, yeah. um, was it a mixed village or all Muslim village? No, no, no. It's a mix, mixed, mixed village. village. Yes. And the school was also mixed school? Oh, yes. School? Definitely. Did you, Definitely. Did you have, what was the relationship like Hindus and Muslims no, and yeah, others? Yeah, uh, the, I must say it was a very good relation, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, basically uh, we people were, uh, what should I say, very friendly, brotherly Quite relation cordial. with the and family. Yes, and very co cordial relation. What about when you went to uh, study in Calcutta? Uh, was that since you are a minority Muslim there, mm -hmm. so was there any difference with you and, and other people there? And the majority Hindus. Uh, no, when uh, I got, or, or? Admi uh, got admitted in this school, mm -hmm. primary school, the Shishu with the Pit, mm -hmm. and then uh, subsequently I went to high school, modern high school. In in Kolkata. Modern co college, uh, oh. modern school. In Calcutta. Yes. Oh yeah, uh, that's in just uh, uh, yeah close by. Uh, uh, yes, by the side of the uh, tram line. Yeah, yeah, Goria Road. Uh, no, no, not Go Goria. Uh, Goria Hat. No, no, not Goriat. Uh, From Park Sakas uh, to Goriat, that, that road on the right hand side? No, but no, anyway. no, no, no. That, that is uh, Shishu Bidapit. Okay. Uh, but modern school is very near to. Uh, oh, uh, Shialda Station or, uh, or, or Molali? Near uh, Molali? Uh, to, uh, towards Molali. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Towards Molali. Okay. So it's, uh, uh, I had been to that school uh, up to 1948. 48? Yes. So, so and after the partition mm -hmm. of Bengal, India, mm -hmm. 
Bengal also. Yeah, absolutely, Bengal. Uh, uh, my interest is more <laughs> of that. Yes. <laughs> so I had to leave because my father uh, thought that uh, when we have got Pakistan, mm -hmm. so we must live in Pakistan. What, were were there were there attacks on your family after forty seven? No, no, no. I, I was in Pakistan's area, but Pakistan's area basically uh, it was. Uh, uh, so to say, the progressive area. area. And also there are a lot of uh, Bengali Muslims. Muslim yeah, Bengali, Bengali Muslims. Particularly. Yeah. Educated. Up. And uh, almost every day they were threatened mm -hmm. to be attacked by the Hindu. Yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, hooligans. Hindu, uh, Hindu yeah. terrorists in the right. But, no, but, but uh, I think the Park Sakas was uh, quite calm okay. and very good your, in this you, community. Your family yeah. was n never touched? Uh, no, no, no. No, Even when no, you went to school and come yeah. back, because you no, lived up there, to there, there was no such uh, uh, incident or anything okay. happened so, to. So you forty eight. You you we were very good friends uh, yeah. in our in my in primary school and also in high school. Okay, so in forty eight, then you 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 come to uh, Pabna. 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 So how was your feeling like for your family to? Move from Calcutta. You know, you already mentioned that they 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 saw Pakistan yeah. has taken place, so they have to go to Pabna. Exactly. So so uh, I was just uh, when I uh, you are a kid. I, 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 I was a kid. Yeah, yes, yeah. and uh, uh, my uh, uh, yeah uh, auntie uh, she was also not uh, really feeling uh, good to keep me with him uh, with, with her. Them? Okay. Uh, she she was alone. Oh, okay. uh, she was alone. But okay. uh, he lost her husband in uh, early days of uh, and what, her age. What was she? She, uh, she was a teacher. Teacher. Okay. Yes. What what is her name? Uh, Salma Khatun. Salma Khatun. Salma Khatun. So she was still she is still teaching now, or no, she no, moved no, to she, Pabna? Uh, yeah. She moved to Pabna. No, no, not that, uh, at that time. Okay. Uh, afterwards. Afterwards. Uh, I think uh, after fifty most probably. Okay. So after a few years, forty-nine or fifty or something. So, so they, were there threats on her? She was living. No, 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 no nothing of the sort. Okay. Uh, when uh, the family uh, all together came to hmm. came back to uh, uh, so-called Pakistan. Pakistan. So uh, everybody asked her to, to come. Come. Okay. That now, was the. Uh, th tell me, I forgot to ask you because um, what's the name of your father? Musa Luhani. Musa Luhani. Well, we have big name, but uh, we Mus just Musa. squeezed it. And, and Say, for example, my name is Kamal Luhani, but uh, my name is a big one. Okay. Abu Naim Muhammad Mustafa Kamal Khan Luhani. Okay. So you told <laughs> told us. So the first, probably first time he knows. Then no, no, thank uh, you, thank uh, you. No, no. Uh, yes. uh, 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 Press release and cover it. Okay. That's a bracket. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, no, nothing. He was looking after the land, okay, land so property. Uh, because, yeah. you know, I mean, that has been uh, very common. Yes. Uh, in American that time, that would be a farmer. Uh, yes. Yeah. Is that's a very... And, and you said your mother passed away when you were very young. Uh, the six, yes. Six, okay. So, <clears throat> so then when you went back to Pabna, how... What was the life like? And now, before Pabna, yeah. in Calcutta. In, in Calcutta, we were very much friendly with the Hindu people. Okay, also. and you 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 socialized with yes. others. Yes. And and uh, and. Uh, uh, so? When I came to Pabna, uh, my neighbor was Sutita Sen. Oh, <laughs> the famous film actress. <laughs> film actress. Okay. Uh, of course, after uh, some days, uh, she went to Calcutta. Uh, her father was there in, okay. uh, working in the municipality, uh -huh. Pabna municipality. Okay. So <coughs> I, I got admitted in Pabna Jala school. Okay. Uh, and uh, I, yeah, uh, in 1952, mm -hmm. uh, I passed matriculation. Okay. And then got admitted in Pabna Edward College. Okay, yeah, it's an uh, old uh, college. Uh, yes, uh, it's a very uh, renowned college at that time. Uh, and from 1952, I started my 
political career. Mm -hmm. I was very much uh, interested in politics. Okay. So to say, uh, the language movement has mm -hmm. given me that teaching. Well, that that brings that, me to the, to this question. Yeah. You are known as a very progressive person, as a protector of minorities, protector of minority rights, um, and and fighter in fifty two and seventy one, and till today what was what drove you to to that focus uh, or that realization <laughs> the, 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 uh, one thing uh, uh, one is uh, 1942 50, 50. firing yeah okay uh, the killing of Oscar. salam barkat yeah. rafiq jabbar mm -hmm. uh, uh, that gave me a, a different uh, way of life mm -hmm. i choose that one mm -hmm. I started uh, taking a uh, yeah, uh, part in the processions. You were in Dhaka then? With, no. You have moved from Pabna to, or you, you were in Pabna then? I, I, at that time I was in Pabna. Okay. But you are moved by uh, the movement then? Yes. Uh, I uh, do uh, attend uh, meetings, mm -hmm. uh, processions, mm -hmm. this sort of thing. Uh, I was just a listener. Yeah. No, nothing else, more than that. Uh, after some time, uh, when I got admitted in the college, mm -hmm. uh, I was uh, surrounded by uh, my, my classmates, mm -hmm. and they started to uh, groom uh, as okay. political worker mm -hmm. and giving some, uh, uh, what should I say, mm -hmm. uh, giving literature of Marxism mm -hmm. uh, and some other political books so that I can be uh, of that ideology mm -hmm. and with them, uh, I can work with mm -hmm. them. We formed a uh, small group, mm -hmm. Pioneers Front. Okay. Uh, and uh, from that front, we uh, also uh, participated in the college election. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. and, and then uh, we uh, came out victorious. Good. Uh, so, uh, so from 40, uh, um, 52, things moved on. There were there were there were movements in 64, 65. So so did you uh, before 71? Do you have any any specific memory you want to share with us? What sort of memory? no that that the the, the social. No, I, I can uh, no uh, one thing I can say. This is my personal experience and how I was uh, driven to. Uh, uh, what should I say? The non-communal uh, mm -hmm. idea, uh, mm -hmm. ideas. Uh, in 1946, mm -hmm. when there was communal riot, mm -hmm. killing, a uh, great yeah. Calcutta killing, as yeah. you know, mm -hmm. uh, I had been to Gaurir Bhatt, okay, the yeah. Maidan. Maidan, yes. And I was looking at people are running, rushing towards one to another, mm -hmm. and uh, in the meantime. I saw some people who were looting some uh, tong, tong ball is it again, mm -hmm. the small uh, shops, shops yeah. uh, soda water bottle, yeah, lemon water yeah, bottle, yeah, yeah. so uh, loot coach. Yeah. So I saw that and then I went to, uh, I went mm -hmm. and uh, everybody was taking some things uh, with them mm -hmm. and they are just breaking the uh, uh, whatever, screw uh, and uh, Drink. yeah, drinking it. Okay. I also picked up two, mm. but I could not break it. <laughs> so uh, I came uh, back to my uh, yeah, residence uh, in Kimber Street, Park Sagas. My auntie call, uh, called me, what is this? Tami Bulamji, this is uh, yeah, a soda uh, yeah, water. How could you get it? Because she did never gives me yeah, uh, paisa, <laughs> no no money. Uh, and she was very strict. Uh, I can't um, uh, yeah fly yeah uh, kites. Yes, okay. I can't play uh, marble. Marble. Uh, I can't play uh, yeah ekka dokka. Yeah. <laughs> so she was very strict. Mm -hmm. So she asked me that, and I said uh, this is the situation. So I have picked it up from there. And she started beating me with lacquery. Oh, stick. Yes. Oh. 
ওই তখন অ্যাকশন লাকড়িতে চারটে পাঁচটা করে উঠতো ওই জাতীয় লাকড়ি দিয়ে দিস after some time when uh, ended the beating and uh, she gave me a glass of uh, sharbat okay uh, yes yeah, sweet water sweet water okay and he told me you don't do it anymore okay if you do it then you will be punished like this and uh, more than that mm. I must say and admit it, that was the teaching. Okay. It turned my whole life. ideology of my life. Okay. Now, thank you. But uh, th- this is the incident, so the me, most since important. Since you are one of the very few, few people, witnesses, uh, who had witnessed that, uh, that Calcutta killing, uh, the riots, um, uh, do you have any other memory other than, other than that? Did you see there were a lot of people killed? Did you see anybody, anybody killed? anybody mm, any any no, other I, I have I, I have because you were very young very uh, very, very yeah. young uh, uh, I was not allowed to yeah, go. go outside yeah yeah, yeah. Uh, because uh, this was a, this for was that a, reason I couldn't see yeah, yeah. but this I have hard listened to uh, many occasion yeah, yeah. Uh, many uh, incidents but okay. uh, um now now uh, when uh, uh, so between then then 52 it changed you and then comes 71 mm-hmm. Be- between this period is there anything that that strikes you that that reminds you or we can come back come to 71 uh, uh, in between i must say that you know uh, as um, uh, yeah, there was martial law mm-hmm. in pakistan yes and we were at that time living in east pakistan ayub khan's martial law. Uh, ayub khan's martial law came and ayub khan uh, tried to impose upon uh, the bengalis mm-hmm. uh, the different culture mm-hmm. uh, of their culture mm-hmm. on us and uh, at the same time uh, when the centenary uh, of uh, rabindranath tagore came in 1961 he came in 1958 mm-hmm. and declared martial law okay. taking over the power from pakistani rulers mm-hmm. and then 1959 uh, we observed 21st february violating the uh, 44 or something like that section 44 for section for 144 144 yes, yes. Uh, we all went to the uh, central shahid minar yeah. and That's observed 21st february yes. that day uh, uh, then in 1961 when the uh, centenary of uh, Ramina Tagore came, mm-hmm. there was almost a restriction on Tagore. Okay. No uh, Tagore song will be uh, yeah, broadcast from the radio, uh, nothing of the sort. Then we formed many uh, organizations. Mm-hmm. Dhaka University formed one, mm-hmm. Dhaka Press Club, we formed another mm-hmm. and another was formed uh, which was known as uh, uh, Robindra Satavarsha Ujjapan Committee Dhaka Purbo Dhaka East Dhaka East Robindra yes. Chagor's Chagor, Chagor, uh, Centenary Celebration, Celebration Committee, Committee. Uh, in that committee mm-hmm. many of our uh, veteran uh, literateurs educationists mm-hmm. Uh, everybody was there so, uh, journalists uh, uh, that was a big committee and it was uh, most probably headed by begum sufia kamal okay uh, and uh, the secretary uh, of that committee uh, i don't remember the name most probably wahidul haq or something like that okay. and we observed it uh, in whole of our uh, country that is east bengal east pakistan that was one thing 
uh, we had to fight with the martial law regime. Where did you? But but uh, we d did never surrender to the ruling or the uh, directions of the martial did you, law. Did you? Did you? Were you arrested? Were you hassled because of this? Uh, in thing? 1962, I was arrested. Okay. Before that, in 1953, also. Uh, 53, I was arrested twi thri thrice. Mm. In uh, <laughs> 1953, that, uh, that most probably in the month of February. That was in Pabna. In, in Pabna. Okay. And then again uh, during the general election in 1954, okay. uh, when United Front was formed and under the leadership of Shere Bangla for Jul Haq, Shahid Sarwadi, and Maulana Bazani. Mm -hmm. Uh, we were the workers uh, here, by, you know, participating in the uh, election, and uh, as you know, the uh, United uh, Front Frontings. came out uh, uh, victorious. Uh, but uh, the same thing happened uh, as uh, 1970. Yes. It was before the Shere Bangla was uh, the chief minister of East Bengal, and the ministry was formed. But uh, after that. The martial law regime uh, promulgated 92A mm -hmm. uh, and sent Major General Iskandar Mirza as the governor of his Pakistan. Uh, so, uh, but uh, in 1961, uh, we uh, protested against the martial law and observed mm -hmm. the centenary of Tagore. Then again, I must say one thing in 1967, mm -hmm. uh, the information minister of the Pakistan government, the Par ma ma yeah, army government, Khaja Shahabuddin, mm -hmm. he declared on the floor of the parliament mm -hmm. that Tagore is not a part and parcel of our literature and education. Okay. So uh, is, it raised some protest in East Pakistan, that is, East Bengal. And all of our organizations, progressive organizations, they got together mm -hmm. uh, and protested it mm -hmm. like anything. Mm -hmm. We formed Sanskritik Shadikar Pradishtha Parishad, that is cultural, cultural uh, uh, self, self governance, uh, uh, determination, uh, uh, cult uh, cultural determination, uh, 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 rights, rights uh, committee. committee. Yeah. We organized three days program in engineers institution okay. in Dhaka. Dhaka. And it was a wonderful, successful mm -hmm. uh, program. And uh, at that time, uh, the Monem Khan, the he was the governor of East Pakistan. Mm -hmm. And uh, he sent two, tr uh, two trucks full of gundas to break the last day's program. Mm -hmm. And at the, uh, that day, uh, Chitrangada was uh, staged. The dance drama. Chitra yeah, the dance drama was uh, staged. Uh, the first uh, show, uh, it was so populated, the uh, attendant. Uh, the Gundas was also confused. Should we uh, attack them or uh, we should we refrain from this? Okay. Then they decided, the leader of the Gundas, he came to me. Uh, he told me, why are you are hesitating? Why don't you go for stage? Mm -hmm. You start your program. Mm -hmm. Then uh, I said, yes, uh, we have some problem. For that reason, we are just waiting. Well, no, 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 no problem. So he, he thought that uh, we are waiting for him. Oh, uh, but uh, it is not our... Then uh, they went back to a nearby uh, restaurant. And, and came she, uh, They came back. Uh, we uh, promised to the uh, attendants mm. that we will have second show. Mm. Please uh, don't overcrowd okay. it. All right, let me, because we have a short time, so, mm -hmm. sorry. Uh, so then let's have 71. 71, we uh, know you uh, have a very prominent mm -hmm. role. So tell us what is the memory of 71, briefly. Uh, 71, I, I was, uh, one, uh, yeah, uh, uh, I, I was a journalist in 19, uh, from 1955. Uh, in 71, I was uh, Secretary General of East Pakistan Union of Journalists. Okay. So we had to 
uh, play a, a role mm -hmm. and uh, whatever is needed, mm -hmm. uh, we had to do it. Mm -hmm. At that time, non-cooperation movement of uh, Sheikh, uh, Sheikh Mujibur Rahman uh, was announced by him. We participated in the program. Uh, in all democratic movement of uh, East Pakistan at that time, against the Pakistani rulers, uh, we did part participate. And then 1971, uh, when the uh, killing started in, on uh, 25th March, uh, we we have to think over, and uh, I was there in Doinik Purbodesh, mm -hmm. okay. uh, which was a publication of Observer Group of Publications, okay. uh, and then uh, I decided to fly away from Dhaka mm -hmm. uh, in the month of uh, end of April. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Till that day, I was in Dhaka. Mm -hmm. And then I had to fly away to some nearby place uh, uh, on the other side of Buri Ganga, okay. Srinagar. And there I met uh, one renowned journalist, Faiz Ahmad. Mm -hmm. He was uh, injured by uh, shell, shells of El Pakistani Shell. Army. Yeah. Yes. And he was in uh, Dhaka Press Club. Mm -hmm. So he requested, if you go anywhere, you please do uh, take me with me, uh, you. We were very good. Uh, we had very good relation. Mm -hmm. He was senior to me. And then uh, we came to um, uh, Dhaka again mm -hmm. from that village, mm -hmm. Srinagar to so Dhaka what again. Was, how, how was the coming from Srinagar to Dhaka? Was it easy? Uh, it, it was very difficult. But uh, we had to. We wanted to come through Munshiganj, okay. but Munshiganj place was uh, already uh, infested by the uh, Pakistani armies. Okay. Uh, they are looking for young uh, people, and many of our uh, people were very young. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, Shahid Rumi, okay. the, the Rumi was with us, mm -hmm. and some other people also. So we ha had to decide the other way. Okay. Then we crossed Buri Ganga. Mm -hmm and uh, came to Dhaka through Chok Bajar. Okay. Chok Bajar. And uh, all of us, uh, we take sh shelter in my uh, house, okay. which was very near to railway station uh, and at the same time bus station. Okay. Kamlapur. Kamlapur, yes. Uh, Motijil uh, AG colony, AGB okay. colony. Okay. And from there, uh, we decided to uh, cross border. We came to Chandina uh, in the district of uh, Kumilla, and from there uh, we had a boat, two boats, and uh, there was a problem. Uh, one gentle lady, uh, she was a, a good friend of ours. Mm, you, you know uh, Dr. M. N. Nandi? I have heard. Bhaskar Nandi, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're okay. uh, his father. Bhaskar, uh, yeah, uh, M. N. Nandi. Uh, assistant was Dr. Bordhan. Uh, Dr. Bordhan's wife, uh, she is a big one. <laughs> uh, she was putting Sindur mm -hmm. uh, on her. Yeah. So we uh, requested to you just uh, put her off. Take but, off. The uh, yeah, she uh, did they agree. Uh, Dr. Bordhan was also insisting to do it. Uh, otherwise, it's very difficult and risky to move through. Uh, this uh, army, yeah. uh, it happened uh, like that when we were crossing through a heart mm -hmm. that is a marketplace, yes. uh, village marketplace. Uh, some informer of the Rajakars, mm -hmm. they could identify that they are passing away. Mm -hmm. So we had to hurry. Uh, then we passed through. We went to, uh, I don't remember the name. But uh, it's a part of uh, Tripura, Tripura uh, Ag near uh, Agartala. Uh, and uh, we went to Calcutta uh, in the month of. Uh, no, uh, by train. By train. So by it's train. A three, four day through, journey. Uh, yes. Uh, yeah. And through uh, Gohati, yeah. 
and at that time Guwahati was very much uh, hot against Bengalis. <laughs> Even now, <laughs> and so probably. The Congress and CPM people, they came to us and they told us that uh, if you feel any problem, uh, remember these names. Okay. Uh, they, these people will be uh, in the station. Okay. So that was also a very good experience. Of, uh, and the whole man, jam-packed uh, mm -hmm. yeah, um, uh, train. Yes. Then we come to... yeah. Uh, Calcutta, Shialda. Sh Sh so you're back home. For you, back home. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and then uh, I was uh, in first day. Uh, I took uh, shelter in Amar Street uh, Police Station. Okay. Uh, there was a mm, relation of our uh, somebody. Uh, there was a very renowned football player, Pratap Hajra. Uh, his cousin was uh, in that yeah, police station. So uh, we took, um, yeah. And uh, after that, I uh, thought, where is uh, Satin Bangla Betar Kendra? Mm. Uh, I couldn't uh, identify where it is. Mm. Then uh, I went to Bangladesh Mission. Mm. Uh, yeah, Sarkas Avenue. Yeah. So I tried to find it out where it is, but I could not. I was uh, just uh, yeah, standing outside of this, uh, yeah, Bangladesh mission and looking at uh, the preparation of the yeah, uh, Nuzul Jayanti, okay. just uh, 25th May. Uh, at that time, Aminul Haq Badsha uh, was uh, a journalist, a reporter in Delhi, uh, Azad. Okay. Uh, he came and he took me to Baligan Circular Road. Okay. Yelwani Bhai, please uh, come with me mm -hmm. and took a taxi mm -hmm. going uh, through the BA uh, uh, near uh, Goriahat. Mm -hmm. And uh, Baligan Circular Road, uh, he told me that this is radio, mm -hmm. uh, two story building. Okay. And he gave me a Turkish towel, it's a big towel. Mm -hmm. And this is your bedding, this is your towel, mm. there, everything. So uh, you you will be here. Okay. Then I started uh, uh, as news editor of uh, Shadhin Mangla Betar Kendra. Uh, we don't ha uh, didn't have any uh, supporting elements, paper, mm -hmm. uh, pen, uh, anything. No table, no chair. <laughs> but you started from there. Oh, yes. There, yeah. Now, we, we don't have much time because, sorry, let me ask a couple of things. And just in very short, briefly, how, when did you come back and how did you come back? Oh, there was a signal from the Fort William, mm -hmm. uh, which was the headquarter of Mitro Bahini. Mm -hmm. uh, Friendly force. Yes. Uh, they, uh, now, one gentleman, assistant director, BSF. Mm -hmm. border, border security, security yes border security force he came uh, and told us please get ready anytime you could be you, you can be called for going to Dhaka. So after after 16th uh, uh, after 16th okay yeah after 16th uh, it is most probably 22nd okay. December uh, in the morning uh, at 4:30 mm -hmm. we went to Damdam airport okay and uh, uh, in Indian uh, Air Force cargo plane, mm -hmm. uh, we had to board it. And then uh, we came to Dhaka. Okay. And uh, I was told you shall have to go to radio station and give running commentary of coming back uh, of the uh, Probashi Shankar, okay. the exiled government. Ex yeah. There, yeah. Okay. So, it's all right, and running committee, I did, never uh, did it. But you so, did. So, I had to. So? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> that is the only co conviction. <laughs> Just a few more questions that we have. Um, do you know if anybody benefited because partition of Bengal took place? That means whether West Bengal, or East Bengal, rich or poor, Hindu or Muslim, anybody benefited? I'm more focusing on Bengal. I, I can't say because okay. uh, this, this political 
what should I say? The uh, Muslim League mm -hmm. uh, regime mm -hmm. uh, that took uh, part uh, yeah, uh, in the power politics, they were benefited. Okay. And the industrialists, they were benefited. Sir, okay. Not the general people, because yeah. they have lost many things. Sure, sure, sure. sure. Um, would you, you know, West Bengal is Hindu majority, Muslims are minority. Muslims have have not fled the, from there to to Bangladesh, mm -hmm. but from Bangladesh is Muslim majority, but Hindus have been fleeing. Yes. Why do you think is a contradiction? The same people, same language. Uh, now, uh, in West Bengal, the mostly uh, Urdu speaking people, mm -hmm. they did not uh, like to uh, yeah, come to Pakistan, but they were very much supporting Pakistan. But Bengali Muslims didn't come? Uh, Bengali Muslims didn't come. Yeah. Many of them. Yeah. We know everybody. Um, uh, Few uh, elites came, but peasants, maybe, maybe, peasants maybe, and maybe, others. Yes. Thank you. No, no. But from East Bengal, it was exodus. Yeah. And uh, many of them, because of the uh, insecurity mm -hmm. in Pakistan, though Muhammad Ali Jinnah told that their country will be of Hindus and Muslims and such. But in practice, it was not that. Yeah. Uh, I'll come to that later. Um, uh, can Hindus and Muslims live together? I do believe. Okay. I do believe. It's all right, I'm all just about the end. Um, is there something you want to add that I didn't ask you? The uh, only thing I can add Oh, what is very uh, pride for me uh, that the 16th December, mm -hmm. when the Bangladesh was uh, free, mm -hmm. uh, the moment uh, it was free, at that time we had a news bulletin, special news bulletin, okay. and which was prepared by me oh. and a voice by me also. Beautiful, beautiful. And it goes to the international and national people. But all, all uh, yeah. Uh, I, I must. Uh, I was not telling anything about it uh, for a long time. Absolutely. Only uh, last year, sure. my friends, uh, those who are with uh, Radio Shadin Bangla Petar Kendra, they told me, why don't you uh, say uh, this? Okay. So, so <laughs> thank you. But maybe if you have that somewhere saved or somebody record, if you can give it to us, we will put that. For you in our uh, with our rubric as a as a uh, historical document, if there is some way you can do that, but that's that's for I I, I don't uh, know the, what is the situation. Uh, I had uh, one thing uh, I could help you. Uh, declaration of uh, Zia Rahman, mm -hmm. which they claim mm -hmm. that Zia Rahman, uh, Major Jia, mm -hmm. uh, is the declare. Uh, yeah, uh, has declared the independence of Bangladesh, which is not correct. Uh, he declared, uh, he read out the declaration in the name of Bongo Bundu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman, the great okay. leader of Bangladesh. Okay. That is in the, uh, in, uh, on 27th of March. Mm -hmm. But they claim that it is on 26th. No. Okay. He did announce one thing. I, Major Zia Rahman, head of the provisional government okay. of Bangladesh. But it was not provisional government or anything. It was a political war. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, oh, above all, one minister, industrial minister, industry minister of uh, Ayub Khan, uh, his name is A.K. Khan. Mm -hmm. He was an industrialist in Chittagong. Mm -hmm. He said, tell that idiot, this is not a not an army coup. This is a political war. Okay. Even that gentleman, a, being a minister of Ayub Khan, he could realize. Mm -hmm. But Major Jiao Rahman could not realize because he went to clear the uh, ship mm -hmm. uh, and uh, bring out uh, arms and ammunition for killing Bengalis. Okay. All right. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you.